y'all will be watching this video Saturday morning, not last couple of Saturdays I've done a frequently asked question video. There really wasn't anything major come up this week as far as questions go, but I just cleared this out right here. This is my old catch pen, and I did a video about this that y'all will be seeing later on sometime, but it's all grown up. I had I had those big uh, galvanized panels, those six foot by 12 foot tall round pipe panels. I think I had about 30 of them right here. I had a squeeze chute and an alley over there. That stuff just, I used to feed cows in here, separate and work calves, stuff like that. And uh, I sold all the panels. I, squeeze, I had a prefer squeeze chute and sold it. And I still got all my gates. I got about 20 something gates. And over here, you can see them, some of them stacked up over there. I still got one, two, three, four, and I think five and six over there to take down. But boy, this stuff jungles up pretty quick. I come through here another day and spray what I could get in here and spray, and then I bush hogged it. And uh, I should have my my loader put on this next week. It's come in now, and I'm gonna pull the rest of these pole, these posts up, get them out of the way and clear the rest of this out because what i'm going to do is i'm going to diss this area right here and i'm going to try to fool around and grow some watermelons i got a good friend of mine that lives local here uh, he grows watermelons every year man he grows some jam up ones i've tried to grow them before really hadn't had no luck but i'm going to try to do it right here i've got uh I've got water and everything right here too when I irrigate them. I got water under that. There's a spigot under that bucket where I used to water the cows out. But I guess one question people ask me that I could answer is uh, why did I sell cows or why did I quit fooling with them? Well, mainly a time factor, really. The It just, man, it just consumed me, you know what I mean? Like I'd come in and I'd cut hay nearly half the night, you know, worked in the woods every day. And I'd cut hay at night and sometimes I'd cut till one or two o'clock in the morning and then I'd try to get it bailed and raked and bailed over the next couple of days. I was by myself too, you know, and then I had to move all that stuff. But I guess it was 2012 or 2013, I can't remember for sure. I took a load to the sale and when I got my check, about flipped out they were cows were just like sky high and i told them at the sale i told them i said uh i said i'll be back next week with the rest of them so i hauled i loaded all the rest of my cows up at one time or over several loads and i went ahead and hauled them in and sold them while uh while they were high and i'm glad i did because right now cows ain't bringing squat crap man so i got out at the right time but and also too just fooling with cows man uh just you know you always go out there you're gonna have one or two you know you're gonna lose you're gonna lose about 10 percent most years of your herd and you know that's tough and cows are just aggravating the, to they can be aggravating to fool with and all that so that's why that's why i quit messing with them so while y'all are watching this video saturday morning me and jason should be filming y'all another hog hunting video so turkey season is over with now and and i really didn't get to turkey hunt no do no whole lot but uh, jason went hog hunting one day this week got three one morning and so me and him up hit the road in the morning and see what we can uh see what we can catch hopefully i hadn't talked to him this afternoon make sure it hadn't nothing changed or anything but maybe i'll have a hog hunting video this this week and see the dogs work and all that good stuff because that's some that's some fun to do uh doing doing that filming that and and all so uh y'all be good have a good weekend this weekend and not sure what Sunday's video. I've got several things I can use for Sunday. I'm not sure what it's going to be right yet, but we'll see y'all later. Later, taters.